What's up guys? This is not what I had planned today. I'm about to tame a bear and then we're gonna go and try and clear one of the pirate encampments or both of them and see what loot we can get, see if we can get anything from it and just check it out because I've not fought the wild pirates before so that'll be cool. I've just spent an hour and a half trying to find a lion. There was three lions on here yesterday and this morning and when I was recording earlier and as soon as I put a taming pen down I couldn't find them, so I went to the other side of the island, because there's like a cluster of islands that are kind of joined together. I went to one of the other ones opposite my base, put another trap down, and uh, the lion that was there has disappeared. So I don't know what's going on, I can't find them. I've spent, like I said, about an hour or so, hour and a half, running around the islands, looking everywhere, trying to find the lions again. Like I said, there was three, then I found another one earlier, so I've seen four, and they've all disappeared. So, rather than waste my time anymore, and instead of wasting the taming pens I've built, um, I've got one just the other side of them trees there in front of me, and I'm going to try and kite this bear over there. Um, the reason I wanted a lion is exactly the same as what I said earlier. I want to get this bear and go and do the encampments, which is what I was going to do on the lion. Um, but I've never had a lion before, so it would have been new for me to do, and also the lion can pick up other creatures and carry him around in its mouth. Um, so it would have been helpful because I really, really want a horse and I know I can pick a horse up with a lion. It would just made tame one easier. But a bear's good and they farm fibre so it's kind of a bonus in a way. So I'm not going to waffle on anymore. I'm going to attract this bear's attention. Try and run myself over there and get him into the taming pen. And once we've got him in the pen, I'll uh, show you how I built the taming pen that I'm using. So let's see if we can get this bear's attention. And again, I've got no idea what level it is. But we've slapped it now. Um, I've got no idea if we can even make it there without it killing me, to be honest. But we're going to give it a go. Oh! Oh! Jump in the water! Jump in the water! Jump in the water! Oh, he's taller than me! Oh, no! Get in the water. I don't dare look behind me to see if he's catching me or not. Oh, I'm gonna say yes, he is. Oh no. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Where's he gone? There he is, okay. That was too close, I'm already on really low health. Um, try and get a long shot on him so I ain't got as far to run. This isn't ideal guys, I know that. Um, like I said, I'd set it up for some lions I'd found. The lions were like right here, I've built the trap the other side, I was planning to just quickly run over, slap it, run back, boom, job done. But yeah, you see this bear's quite far away. Is that one with him? Oh, what a shot. He's stuck on the rock. Here he comes. Right. I'm running a bit slow because I've got a vitamin deficiency. I need to try and take another hit. I think I can do it. Oh, here we go. Alright, he's lined up anyway. Right, let's get him in. Oh, that was close. I'm literally one more hit. Right, now we've got to... Uh, Get some damage on him. Just got to put some boilers in here. Oh, I've just realised I don't know if I've actually got the uh, food he needs. We'll have a look. Berries, this will do. Okay, he's only level four. Don't know how well she's going to tame out. Um, but it gives us a start. We've got some in tamed. And like I said, they farm fibre. So and I've actually seen another bear. So maybe we can try and grab that one and see what level that is. I'm not saying when she's going to want feeding. Oh, there we go. 20 seconds. Oh, I can get another berry on her. Um, you got to be careful when you're doing this, guys. Um, if you don't know, if you sit at the wrong angle, they can hit you. 
Um, I'm getting kind of lucky. I don't know if she's bugged out a little bit, but normally they'd start hitting you. Oh, I can get another one in before she gets out, hopefully. Right, now I'm going to wait just a couple of seconds before I put another bowler on it. Oh god, that made me jump. Fucking hell. Yeah. See what I mean if you get the wrong angle. God damn, I actually nearly had to change my pants then. Bloody hell. Well, while we're waiting for this last one, here's how I built this taming pen and a little quick breakdown of what you need to do it. So to start with, find somewhere nice and flat that you can put down your foundations and ceilings and no hassle, as flat as you can anyway. Then you want to lay out the foundations, three by three, six in total, and snap three ceilings on each end, depending which way you want to run animals into, to give you a rectangle shape. Then snap doors down each side of the taming pen, um, and then once you've got the walls in, you can try and snap the ramps in. Now there is an issue with the ramps, that they need something behind the bottom of the ramp to snap to. So you're going to have to put an extra ceiling on each end. Uh, just one to put the first ramp in, and then you can snap the other ramps to the first one. Once you've done that, just to be safe, get a couple more walls, turn them to half walls, just because it looks nicer. And put them in the middle section of the taming pen, just to stop anything climbing out. You should be alright, but you never know, and it's better to be safe than sorry. So in total you need 6 foundations, 8 ceilings, 6 ramps and 16 walls and that will give you this taming pen I've built here. This is entirely made from wood obviously so it's nice and cheap and easy to get and you can tame almost everything in this and later on you can just build the exact same thing and make it out of stone and you can tame like elephants and stuff in it. Hey, tamed it. Right. Um, now the only problem is I'm going to have to take these ramps out but whatever. Well, we'll let it heal up and we'll go see if we can get a saddle made. Just had to go and get some honey because um, I feel you need organic paste to make the tier 2 saddles, which needs making the mortar and pestle using, well, sugar and uh, fibre, I think it is. If I remember right, I'll have a look in a minute anyway. Um, honey is something you can use for the sugar, obviously. So I've been and got that. And uh, yeah, I need to get my mortar and pestle set up. So I thought, well, we're going to put a table down because. Um, I don't like having a mortar and pestle on the floor. Let's get that. There, that'll do. Huh, ah, there we go. <laughs> uh, I actually like, this is sad, but I really like the tape on this game. It's got like a nice bit of decoration on it. It's not just a simple everyday table, you know. They've put the effort in, looks good. And uh, I appreciate it. So hopefully, stick some silk in there, some honey, and boom. That'll do. Save that in case we need it for anything else, and that should be more than enough to make this saddle. Ah, there we go. I think it's a tier two saddle. I'm sure it is. Bears tier two, so I'm assuming it's the tier two saddle. Oh, this could be uh, a bit of balls up. I think that's right, though. Hey, there we go. Damage. Hi. Look at it. Oh, such a good level up. Um, I'm going to wait for morning because uh, although I think you can see kind of decently, um, I think it will be better in the daytime. Looks good. Look at her. Let's get on the saddle then. Here we go. So, um, they like pick up speed as they run, and if you turn sharp, they slow down like you like she just done there. But uh, they're pretty quick. They're a pretty quick mount. Pow! And they are, you know, they do a nice bit of damage. But if I remember rightly, also if you come up to some of these little bushes like this and you right click. Gavas fibre, oh boy, so good. The fibre grind is over, and you don't need a sickle. You just jump on the bear. So good. But well, I'm going to run around this way. I hope we can get around here. Now, 
do I go straight in and see what she can do? Or do we get a few levels? You know what? Let's get a few levels. I don't want to lose her straight away. She is only low level, so she's not going to be a super tank. Although they are pretty tanky. It also, when you um, gather hides and stuff off of the creatures, um, if you right click, they it's like a finesse type thing, and they gather more, more um, hide and stuff like that. Ooh. And if you press C, they stand up. Looking good. Oh, I was only level two. Definitely killed this one. Hopefully, some high level ones might spawn here then. And we want to get a draft. Oh, it's killed a chicken. Get back here, you! You're not meant to run away. Oh, it makes such a difference when you get a bear or a tiger or something aggressive on this game. It's so, so good. Um, I could actually probably go and do some treasure maps now. Just jump on my sleep, try and squish my bear on there somehow, and um, off I could go and collect some gold. But I'm going to wait until I've got my shooting before I go and do that. But I think we'll go have a crack at that wild pirate camp now. Right, okay. Just get the stamina back, and I think we're good to go. I really hope this guy's alright. <laughs> it's got two chance in it. And if not, there's another bear on the island, so we'll just tame that. It's all good. But I want to see what we can get from these, because I've got a feeling we might be able to get some weapons and stuff, which would be real nice. Oh boy. Okay, so far so good. Boy. One Get these, turn around! I'm struggling to turn. Why is it gone really dark? Oh, wait, they can hit me! Oh, not good. Okay, we weren't expecting that. Gotta get out. Oh, I didn't think of that. Oh, boy. Oh, no, I'm stuck! Get me out! Come on! Zigzag, zigzag, serpentine. Little serpentine, don't want to turn too much, he'll stop running. Oh, she stopped running. Oh, out of stamina, quick jump off. I actually think we're safe, I think we're safe. Oh, I need to get back in and see what we got. Oh, I weren't paying attention, I was getting slapped. I was like, hang on a minute, why is she bleeding? She's still on like half health. Pretty good though, She's super tanky. God damn, she took an absolute beating in there. What a hero. Now, I'll wait to heal up a minute, and um, we'll go back. Ah, oh, damn it, now there's a heat wave. I'm going to have to wait, otherwise I'm going to die of heat exhaustion. Try and get wet to see if that um, helps a little bit. Got wet, and then literally instantly started getting the uh, overheating debuff. <laughs> <laughs> I always thought that worked. I'm sure it helps a little bit, but I ain't certain. Well, I'm going to have to run back to my base quick and see if I get him a hut if that will um, stop it. I just can't seem to get rid of this overheating right now. And I'm on super low health still from uh, that fight. But I'm hoping they don't despawn and stuff. I really want to go and see if we um, can loot anything from there. Oh, I am going to have to go around this way because I can't get over them rocks. Stupid pig, get out of the way! Oh boy. Sod off. I'm not even sure if this is going to work. No, I think we're just going to die. Oh man! Alright. God damn, this game is a savage. Right, the heat wave's gone, but I nearly died again. Um, can't really do much about it just now because I haven't got any fortitude and I don't have a parrot. So, just got to deal with it. 
But I definitely think staying wet helps against it. But anyway, I've got to wait for health to come back now. <laughs> I will get back to that encampment. Pow! Pirate! Yeah, boy! Looking good. Got a full set of hide armor now, so... Won't do me much good for the heat, to be fair. But at least now we'll be a bit more tankier when we get to the encampment. But what I'll actually do... Just put the cloth back on. Because cloth definitely um, helps against the heat. And get it all wet. Plop. Yeah. And I'm almost back on full health now. Hopefully some of this fish is cooked. Because I'm hoping if I actually keep uh, all of my... Oh, wrong one. I'm hoping if I keep all my vitamin levels the same, then uh, it might help with my fortitude and stuff. So, hopefully that'll work. Anyway, let's head back over there. Basically full health now. Um, and I will tame a parrot soon. I might do that in the next episode. We'll get a parrot, because that'll be handy. Obviously, I keep getting heat waves on this island. They're not like all the time I've built a base before. It was actually a starting base, annoyingly, on um, the first time I played Atlas. On a desert island. <laughs> and it was an absolute nightmare. Um, just constantly overheating. There was no water. No fresh water. There was like one place on the entire island that you could just about dig and dig up water but at that point in the game you couldn't fill water bottles on it so you had to just run there and get a little bit of water it was really annoying in the end I um oh, I'm out of stamina in the end I had to keep sailing to a free port with water barrels and filling the water barrels up when they when I run out of water but uh, it was kind of cool. It was a nice little challenge, to be fair. But yeah, it was, God, it was annoying. Right, oh, we're back on the cannons. Let's get in here. Come on. Hopefully, the ones we've already killed haven't despawned. Oh, hit a tree. And uh, we're still gonna loot them. Oh, that one hit me. Get out of the way, silly tree. Oh, there's so many trees. Stuck on, stuck on someone. There's one dead. Heavy pirate level 18. These are, um, you know, they're not super low level. I just didn't realise I didn't even put my um, high armor on. I just made an effort to go and get. I'm actually stuck. Right, okay. How can I um, get to these? Can I destroy this? Um. Oh. Didn't even realise I could do that. Uh oh. Why is that not doing damage? Bugged out? Are they not killable? Uh, I don't know what's going on here. Can I kill this one with the bear? I'm stuck on it! Oh no! Right, maybe if I get into the centre here. Right, can I claim this or something? Attempt to claim. Four pirates still left in the area, but it's not letting me. Oh, there we go. I'm stuck. Always that happens. Come on. Can't get through with a bear. Can I loot? Or does she just despawn? Oh, the other ones might be there somewhere in the grass then. Oh, no. I can't loot them. Don't mind me. Just carrying the body around. Release. And we can chop them up. 
Ah oh, man, I thought we had a loot or something. I can access the other inch of the loom. I can't open that loot box. Maybe I can smash it open somehow. Um, if I come around this side. Ooh. Jump off the bear. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. God damn it. Right, let's put my uh, hide armor on for one thing. Oh, that's a guillotine. If I try and punch her, that seems to. That seems to get the aggro on them. Oh, that's got all of them. There we go. That's weird. So you can't, I can't seem to like shoot them to get get an aggro. I've got a melee them, but them two have now come off the cannons after I hit this front one. So I'm not entirely sure how that works. And I'm really, really disappointed. I can't loot them. But does this work? <laughs> Where's it gone? Where's it getting? Ah, oh, they blew it up. I wanted to try and stick their body in it. Damn it. So now if I claim this then. Encampment claimed. Level up available. So now is there loot in here? Ooh. There is. Gold. Oh, a blue and white shirt. A shield. Nice. A bow. Oh, that's 106%. That's a higher rated common bow then, I think. Oh, nice. Okay, well. Yeah. Any little upgrades, an upgrade. Alright, cool. Well, let's head to the uh, second encampment on the other island then. See if we can get anything from there. Oh, okay, I waited overnight, so hopefully we can uh, see what we're doing properly. There it is. Boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh no, I can't get my bear in. Get in. Yeah, we ate. Oh, there's a lot of them in here. Oh, bear OP, look at it. Oh my god, this is. This is easy. Oh my god, honestly I'm not playing on any funny settings or any mods or anything. This is apparently the hardest difficulty, so, you know. It's how good a bear is. And this is only a low level camp as well, obviously. But, I mean the bear doing the damn thing. So are these ones going to let me hit them? Don't think they are. Can I shoot them with the bow? Weird. Can I loot these? Oh, I'd love to loot him. Look at his flak armor and stuff. Let me drag him out. Can I drag him? Yes. Look. Look at his armor. I want it. Oh man, I can't loot it. But that armor looks sick. Look at it. I want it. Black and silver. Anyway. So you know, like the last one. Ah, oh, some war drums. I wonder if I can play them afterwards. Um, yeah, like the last camp, the only way I could get them to aggro me was to look at her arms, was to punch them. Punch this one as well. There we go, that's got a ball, I think. Oh, and there's one left. You crack on with them, bear. I'm stuck. Bear? Bear? God damn, I thought he was going to stop hitting them, man. Yeah, it's all of them now. Watch the drum kit. Oh, I broke the drum kit! No! I wanted to play the bongos. I think we got them all. Can't see any chests in there. Oh, there's a chest in there. Alright, okay. 
The climate. Yeah, island conquered. Oh boy, I are pirate, get off me island. That was awesome, I had good fun on that today. I'm gonna get the bear back. I've got to think of a name for her as well. If you've got a name suggestion, leave a comment below and maybe I'll name it after your name. Um, so yeah, I'll see you in the next one.